I've been in the US for the last time in the late 2019 and I must confess I had a hard time figuring out the gross or the total amount to pay every time I wanted to buy something or just to pay the restaurant bill just to give an example taking a look at the tax or the prices in general they put the number and you basically have to add the VAT on top same for every purchase so the total is the sum of the net plus the VAT you have to do the math and I'm an accountant so fortunately in Italy things were just for this case okay don't celebrate too much are pretty straightforward they try to facilitate the reader the customer every price tag restaurant menu has to show the total amount to including the VAT so there is almost no surprise when you have to pay for the meal however if you're paying a professional a service provider or any medical treatment things may change a bit in Italy the VAT is known as Imposta sul Valore Aggiunto IVA the rate is a flat 22% that's the average it's applied on the majority of goods and services for some other items or goods such as food and beverage for example the VAT rate is just 10% and by the way this payment split should be reported in the payment receipt so take a look the next time you enjoy your pizza please last category for the VAT is just the free VAT expenses those related to your health care like the dentist medical treatment in general and all the professional fees of those who opt for the flat rate called regime forfettario the VAT or the IVA basically is the pure tax for customer or client but the professional or the business owner for them it's a neutral obligation in other terms he has to pay the VAT paid by his customers to the revenue agency with the benefit of deducting the VAT he paid for business expenses very often in Italy service providers restaurants shops like to offer a very Italian nice trade they say pay me cash and I'll cut the VAT of the total so to give you let's say a 10% 22% discount if you pay cash only or under the table for your side it sounds like a no-brainer unless you have some house renovation cost or relevant medical costs to deduct their side they save income taxes so before saying yes ask yourself what happens if you pay cash yes you get a x percent off but you say goodbye to any possible tax benefit and more likely any refund if the service is not good enough you know what i mean